What's up, everyone? Giant Opinions here. Some breaking, breaking San Francisco Giants news. Giants have went ahead and signed starting pitcher Kevin Gosman to a one-year, $9 million deal, I believe. Uh, this is an interesting move, to say the least. I don't really think anyone saw the Giants going after Kevin Gosman specifically, even though we did know that uh, we were going to try and sign a veteran starting pitcher. We did not think it was going to be him. And now this is only a one-year deal, but granted, it, it, we are paying him a decent amount of money, $10 million for a guy who, let's just face the facts, he hasn't really been that good in his career. His best season was in, I believe, 20, 2016. He had like a 3.49 ERA, which is pretty respectable, but he hasn't, I mean, besides that year, he's kind of had, he's going to been in the upper fours, even some of the fives in some years, uh, ERA-wise, so he is a little suspect, but uh, he was somewhat regarded at one point in his career, and he does have some nice pitches. His fastball and his splitter are some nice pitches. But this signing is kind of, it kind of reminds me of the Drew Pomeranz last year. Zaidi has a thing of where he will sign players to deals and then he will try and ship them off if there is value there. That happened last year. We got Dubon for Pomeranz and people are kind of like overlooking the Pomeranz deal. But it did pay out to work and now the Giants have a, a core piece in Dubon. But I, I actually, this move is okay. If you're a Giants fan, I know you're probably like, why Why aren't we re-signing Bumgarner? This money should have been to Bumgarner, but I don't really think so. I do actually like this move because I think I think we will find a way to, uh, to channel the talent in Kevin Gosman. And if he does have a good ERA, we will ship him at the deadline. I can almost guarantee that because we are still rebuilding. We're not a playoff team with Kevin Gosman. But I like the move, Zaidi. He has a thing, and I kind of like his. I kind of like his philosophy, where if you can sign someone on a one-year kind of prove it deal, and if they eventually or if they have a good season, you can ship them off for value. I think that's a very smart move to acquire prospects and build up the farm system, which is what he's trying to do. So I actually kind of like the move. Let me know what you guys think, uh, and I will see you all in the next one.